A Prosper cheerleader paralyzed in a freak tumbling accident in September is showing signs of improvement. Michaela Noble suffered a serious spinal cord injury while practicing off campus. She continues her recovery, inspiring others. Fox 4's Lauren Lynn Ann Wynn has her story. Lynn Ann. Well, Clarice, since the accident, thousands across the country have followed Michaela Noble's journey. Today, she is back home and going to physical therapy, making improvements each day. They told me, like, you're never going to walk again. Like, you're not going to be able to do this. You're not going to be able to do that. And I'm kind of, I've just kind of always had the mindset, like, you can't tell me what I can and can't do. Just two and a half months since doctors told her she'd never walk again. Oh, all of this is so much different. Michaela Noble is small but mighty strides, like breathing on her own and rolling over. Oh my God. Nice. Something physical therapists told her typically takes weeks to do. She accomplished on her third try. I don't like being told that I can't do something because I'm like, I'm going to prove you wrong. Like, I'm going to do it and we'll do it better than you think I can do it. In September, Michaela was practicing a flip at a friend's house when she landed on her neck. I knew instantly that I was paralyzed. I just kind of hit the ground and it was just kind of like a tingling sensation through my whole body and I just couldn't feel anything below my neck. She spent weeks in ICU before moving to inpatient physical therapy for her spinal cord injury. The family says the outpouring of community support has helped them through some of their toughest days, from meals provided by friends to essential equipment like a wheelchair and an electric lift donated by strangers. Just to know that we're not in this alone, that there are people praying for us and supporting us. Michaela continuing to be an inspiration to many, celebrating each small victory. It's just like, oh my gosh, you can sit up without support or like yesterday, like you can roll over. And honestly, I am more proud of her now accomplishing those things than I was when she was a baby and accomplished them. And it's only up from here. There's always going to people that going to be people that have it better than you and there's always going to be people that have it worse than you but you have so many things to be thankful for and it's just you don't realize that until they're taken away. And Michaela will continue with physical therapy about three times a week and she does hope to eventually return to school in person to finish up her senior year and go on to college.